Hi, and welcome to this introduction to a SQL database course. In this course, I'm going to take you through all the steps to build the application you see on the screen. So this is a database of albums and the tracks that go with them. You'll also be able to have a video player when you're done so that you can play your favorite music. So the main parts of this course are to learn how to design and use databases. So we will take you through the process of not only building and writing SQL statements, but also designing an application. So that goes with both object-oriented programming and designing tables. So not only will you create a simple application with one or two tables, but we'll talk about designing multiple tables and the relationships that go with them, which is called creating a foreign key. As part of the course, you'll learn how to write SQL statements. So SQL is the language of databases for selecting, deleting, and updating different records. So here's the entire course outline. We'll start with installing MySQL and MySQL Workbench, which are the tools that you use to design databases. We'll create tables from scratch. We'll talk about the different data types that go in them and the best practices of how you design them. We'll create relationships between tables, which is obviously important because it is a relational database that we're working with. We will write the SQL queries, which means that we'll be able to communicate using the SQL language. We'll create a full front-end application to go with it, because in many experiences of a database course, you might learn how to create tables and write SQL statements, but it sometimes feels divorced from real-life experience. So in this case, we're going to create a very simple front end that we can see our database in action. When you're done, you'll be able to add, delete, and edit database records in your SQL database. This course is found at studycoding.org, where you'll not only find SQL databases, but also application development for web apps and mobile apps using Java, C Sharp, PHP, JavaScript, and other languages. So if you haven't seen the courses yet, please stop on by and check out studyquoting.org. I'll see you there.